<laughs> Hello! People, my name is Kale Boss. Hmm? The only boss. <laughs> oh, wait, what is? Ah, have you heard? Wait, do you know that Tap Tap Send is live in Texas? Oh, you didn't know. We went to New York. Now we are live in Texas. So people in Texas and around, all you have to do is to download Tap Tap Send. Yes, Tap Tap Send has become the most unique, secure, and fast way of sending money across the world to your loved ones anywhere. Okay? So download Tap Tap Send on Google Play Store or App Store. And when you're in Texas or around, you just have to put in the code TXGH. What did I say? T X G H and you get ten dollars for your first transaction you make. Hey, but yeah, my hammer made it. Texas, you drew huh? Very soon we will conquer everywhere. <laughs> Download Top Top Send now on Google Play and App Store. Top Top Send, it's secure, convenient, easy, and fast. <laughs> A Becker Group of Companies and Sami Flex TV present September to Remember. And in September to Remember, Dubai tour with Sami Flex. Eti ye mwa kwenye na honi yako Dubai. Na mwa kwenye wa nisu adie. Na fe ya sansu wa jie ni abu. Na yebeko tour of places biti se. Desert Safari. Dubai Frame. Atlantic's Water Park. Dubai City Tour. Na fe yach party nisu tuye tia. Na ya sansu wa party in the cloud. Eti ye mayen kwa mani ya mekanchero. Da bi ya ye September to Remember. Dubai tour with Sami Flex. Na ye basu 24th September. Di kwa si 29th September. Anne. And for any reservation. And now send you the Chirimubia. And your friends are home at True 0243-514732. And now plus 971-559-494061. Proudly sponsored by Sankofa Restaurant. Taste Africa. On Hinebaji My TV. And now for EDK Media. September to remember Dubai tour with Sammy Flex. Ebe ye kikim. In this edition of the editorial, I'm going to handle a letter written by one of the guys that I have been loving for the past months, weeks, because of his understanding of the agenda of Ghana's entertainment industry. Online, I have been following his statement on his radio and TV show on 3 Music, and I think that the kind of mindset he has is what we all need as an industry. I have been following his exploits in the field of journalism in the entertainment industry, and I think I, I, I think I am in line with him. Sometimes his thoughts are my thoughts. Sometimes some of his statements, his approach, sometimes they are my, my approach. And today, looks like on this road, we were not on the same agenda. And I'll be telling you why in a GFE. This I'm doing with all the respect I have for him and I have for the industry. This I'm, not, I'm doing not with any malice, but this I'm doing to also supply information just as he also supplied information to his readers online, especially on Facebook. And I know he controls a good number of um, respect and following and value. So anything that he puts out also comes out with that bang, with that kind of strength. So if I read... I loved it and also have something to supply. Why not? I'm allowed to do that. Join me on this journey, editorial here on Sami Flex TV, and let's do this. If you are a first timer on this channel, remember my name is Sami Flex. I am about to give you my perspective on the issues here in our industry, and that is the editorial. I don't do this alone. I do it with my crew people. That's my production people. Digital Rasta is also called Currency. He's on camera. Rich Flex is the editor director of the show. And I know you out there, you're also a partner to this channel, reason you've been watching us. If you love what we do, you can put your comments there and be part of the conversation. You can also like our page, subscribe to us, so you can watch some of our videos, either to come or those that we have put out already in Jesus' name. Meanwhile, Top Top Send is an app that I recommend to you. Maybe you live abroad. Yeah, I know very soon to be Christmas and many people will be sending money down for festivities, celebrations, um, bills, left, right, and center to support family and friends. Just ask. Um, 
Professor Ankonan Rebo has been sending some to us for us to spec up our studio. So if you are also thinking about that, get the app on your phone today, download it and put in the bank details as well as your promo code, which is Samiflex. If you put in the promo code, which is Samiflex, what it does is it helps you to make some more money, extra money into your wallet so you can send all these monies back home. When you go to Dubai, Tap Tap Send is active there. When you go to Netherlands, Tap Tap Send is also active there. And this time round, you can also do so via Ideal. And it is there. You should know this and know peace. Now, let me go on straight to read the piece that my good friend Olele Salvador put out. And um, we will handle it the way we have to handle it professionally. Then we go. So this was done on Monday. I read... It would be greatly appreciated if Shatawale utilized his impact and influence to nurture more talented artists and create captivating beats, which he is also known for as the maker, rather than consistently offering his thoughts on the state of the, of Ghana, of the Ghana music. He says, it would be greatly appreciated if Shatawale utilized his impact and influence to nurture more talented artists and create captivating beats, which is also known for as the maker, rather than consistently offering his thoughts on the state of the Ghana music industry. And even to start reading, I pick two things from this. One, um, Olele Salvador is, is trying to retire Shatawale one way or the other, because he says Shatawale should rather nurture artists and create beats for them. That is my first understanding. You can also have a different understanding, and that is fair. That is fine as well. But reading the first paragraph, my understanding is that, okay, so he wants, at the moment, Shatawale to stop everything he's doing, in, including creating songs for himself, but rather look for talent, nurture them, and produce beats for them. Turn to a producer and produce beats for them, so they will come. And again, he's also trying to prevent him from having thoughts, from having conversation about the industry. Then I opened my mouth in awe. Then I asked myself, oh, so if Shatawale, with all his experience in this game, is being prevented from having industry thoughts and discussions, then who is the right person to talk? Those who have the experience, those who have seen it all, if they are being cautioned not to talk, then who are those to talk? The newbies? No. I did not get it. Now, let's continue. It says, considering his immense success and the respect he has garnered, it is unfortunate that there are no notable disciples from his camp who have emerged as great artists in their own right. Mm. 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 Sometimes, when I'm reading some of these things, and it is coming from some quarters like this, I ask myself, ah, is there an issue? Is there a problem? Because when he says, considering his immense success, and the respect he has garnered, it is unfortunate that there are no notable disciples from his camp who have emerged as great artists in their own right. So, my understanding is that since his days at, at Nima, all the dance hall boys that came out from him, and for some reasons, they could not push hard to be where they are. It is Shatawale's cause for them to fail. It is Shatawale who did not let them become great musicians. If I want to read further into the story, he mentions Samini bringing Stone Boy. He mentions Stone Boy bringing Kelvin Boy. He mentions Samini bringing um, 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 Kofi Kinata. He mentions Sarkodie bringing Akwabua and Strongman. And ah, I was expecting him to have known better. If every artist since Shatawale's days at Nima at that time, I know there was a click, dance hall click. If all these guys had worked hard for themselves. In fact, the guys who are, you are mentioning, it's not someone who made them. They strived to make it themselves. They worked hard. Like, look at Stone Boy. Ever since Samin introduced him, he has been hungry for success. It's not anybody telling him, oh, look at Kevin Boy. When he broke off from um, Stone Boy's label, knowing that he, he doesn't want to be seen as a failure, he has been striving hard. 
Look at Strongman. If you listen to him, he says when he left uh, Sarko, the success label, uh, success music label, that is when he even decided to work extra hard. So he will be seen and that nobody will think, oh, he's enjoying Sarko's fans. No. He, is, he did not do like that. Akwabua, he wants to do it. In this world, that's why we say that if you meet someone who doesn't want to learn, you can even pat the person's head and put book in it. If the person doesn't want to learn, the person doesn't want to learn. Now, let's talk about artists that Shatawale has given them platforms. At least, we might not go far. We can even use the militants. And you think it is Shatawale that is not making them shine? You think it is Shatawale that is not making them get breakthrough? You think it is Shatawale that is not what, raising them? Oh, oh, sometimes when I read out these days, I, I marvel, like, hmm, did someone really sit down to write this? It makes it look funny. Like, is there an agenda? Is there a problem that we need to sit to solve? And I'm ready to do that. This one I'm ready because Olele Salvador is a level-headed guy, so I'm ready to sit down with him so we solve this amicably, respectfully, and beautifully. Look at the number of boys that Shatawale has given them face, popularity. Join 77, um, uh, Captain, um, Adiself. Just mention them. In fact, you can go ahead and mention all the uh, Arabi and all, so many people, all in the name of Dance Hall from Nim at that time. Like I said, it was a click. Um, RIP to the late, uh, what's his name? Um, uh, Rude Boy Ranking. Thank you, Currency. RIP to Rude Boy Rank. All these guys, they had some kind of connection with Shatawale growing up. But unfortunately, as to why they are still not there, you can't blame Shatawale. No, nobody should try to do that. Ah, what should he do? Do you know how hard Shatawale works? Sometimes, well, they say when someone doesn't know you, he calls you a bee. Do you know how hard Shatawale himself works? Like you move with a boss. Your boss is working day and night. You, you are sleeping. And if you are not successful in life, you go and blame me. My boss did not make me successful. How? You meet the boss, I'm working. You are sleeping. He said, I did not make you become successful. Hey, if you know how Shatawale works on his songs, production, left, right, and center, even the hits that he's made with these boys, stages that he's mounted with them, traveled with some of them, platform that he's created for them, and today, someone thinks Shatawale has not done anything for anybody. Oh, Charlie. Maybe I would have to stop reading soon and uh, let's wrap up. Because the more I continue, it looks some way. Um, he says, Shatawale often preaches about unity, yet he seems reluctant to unite with his fellow artists to collectively make the statement he so passionately urges Ghanaian artists to make. If he is not leading the church, he refuses to join it. This mindset cannot prevail at all times. Sometimes, <coughs> sorry, sometimes one's impact can be felt even as a backing vocalist, as exemplified by Olamide and Ashake. I dare him to rise to the occasion, utilize his technical expertise, and contribute positively to the ecosystem rather than constantly criticizing it. Mm. Yeah, same on. He says Shatawale should preach, Shatawale preaches about unity but does not. And I preach about unity if your ways are not my ways, how do we do it? You have been in this country where Shatta has said that he has planned some things with some artists. Later, the artist went behind him and did some things. So how do they plan together? We have been in this country where Shatta only has said that he's called some of his people. Guys, let's go this way. Let's do it this way. Let's handle it this way. Yet, they also have their own plans. So they go and do it their own way. How do you blame Shatta Wale for this? We've been in this country where Shatawale has said several times that sometimes he wants to sit down with, with these people so that they plan on how to do some things. But they also think they have their way. And I think nobody should begrudge anybody. In fact, as I sit here, I can't begrudge any ad other artist who is not waiting for Shatawale. If Shata won't go, they will go. If Shata won't take, they will take. If Shata won't do, they will do. After all, Shatawale has been out of VGMA. He went out with Stone Boy. Stone Boy has rejoined. He's still out. Why should this become a problem? Because Shatter has rejoined and Stone, Stone Boy has rejoined. Shatter has not joined. It should be a problem. I, I don't know what it means. Then it says, um, it says, I dare him to rise to the occasion, utilize his technical expertise, and contribute positively. 
You said he shouldn't contribute to this. Now you're saying he should do what and what and what and what. How do you want him to handle all these things? I think it is a wrong approach. Now, let me try to wrap up this reading. Um, it's, it continues that, um, while it is understandable that Shatawale does not wish to be compared, it is worth reminding him that Sarkodie has given us Akwabua and Strongman, while Samini did with Kofi Kenata and Stoneboy, and Abwai gifted the ecosystem with Kelvin Boy. Unfortunately, not, man, not much can be said about Shatawale's militants, which is a complete failure on his part. Ah! <laughs> oh, only Le Salvador! He says, unfortunately, not much can be said about Shatawale's militant, which is a complete failure on his part as a leader. Mm. Mm. So Shatawale should do what? Beat them to be successful musicians? Well, let's wrap up. He says, we are all responsible for the current state of affairs. Now I'm sure you are coming home. We are all responsible for the current state of affairs. Insulting your, our mothers and telling us you have more money than us has never solved the problem. So how about you actually get to work and show us what you got, Onupa? Well, once again, these are the things he believes in and those are the things he shared. Unfortunately, maybe we have different wavelength on this particular issue. I told you that, yes, I love his approach on so many things, but maybe on this particular one, we could not agree to it. And this is what I came to do in a more respectful manner. I still want to believe that some of the points he touched on could have been better if handled differently. Like about the militant, it is not Shatawale to make them successful. It is their own work. In fact, even as parents, their children, every parent would want their child to be successful. In fact, a parent who doesn't want his or her child to be successful, I don't know who that parent will be. Every parent. But yet, we see some people who strive to be better than others. We see some people who strive, who strive to lead and even come back to support others. Would you blame the parent for doing all this? Unfortunately, this is how we have to end it. But for information, this particular piece could have been handled perfectly. This particular piece that looks like demonizing Shatawale, making him look like a failure, is not what it is. Satawale has done a lot for the industry. He's led the industry to chart so many parts that has been successful. In fact, everybody who knows this game would agree that if there's one guy who even gave artist confidence to command money, Satawale is one of them. I remember Sakwadi went for an interview in South Africa. He said, yeah, Shatawale, yeah, that's my crazy brother. Yeah, I love him for some of his initiatives. Just that his ways, of course, Sakode knew what he was talking about. He knows that Shatawale has been one initiative leader in our industry, of course. His ways can't be your ways, and that is, that is what makes him weird. And if you listen to some of his songs, he said, do, do what you want to do, I'll do the opposite. Do what you want to do, and I'll do the opposite. So you do what you want to do. To him, he said he would do the opposite. Unfortunately, this is where people don't get. Unfortunately, this is where people take advantage of to attack him. But that is not the solution. Let's look for the right solution. Like he said, we are all in this mess together. Until then, be safe. I'll meet you again when I meet you. My name is Sammy Flex. We're out of here.